the second movement of the trumpet sonata is very much influenced by folk music. And actually, folk music from the British Isles. Um, there's a particular rhythm that's used in Scottish music called the Scotch snap. Sort of short, long, short, long, that da-dum, da-dum. And right from the beginning, you're going to be hearing that melody very prominently in the trumpet. And the music, and the way I view this uh, particular movement to be played is that it should feel it should almost feel like folk music. It should be sort of gentle. And this is in contrast to the first movement, which had so much contrast in it. The second movement does have different ideas, but the main idea is of this folk theme. So now here's the beginning of the second movement of the sonata. The second movement of the sonata is in an ABA form. The A sections are the simple folk melody. The B section at the heart of the piece is very mysterioso. Some of the same material that you hear in the A section does appear in the B section. But in contrast to the, the gentle major feel of the A section, in the middle it's much more chromatic in minor key. And there's additional material which really gives it this middle section a feeling, as I said, of mystery. At the tail end of the B section, there's a chorale that leads to the gentle return of the folk material for the final A section. But right now we're going to demonstrate for you this middle, mysterioso, yet dramatic B section. <laughs> 